December 2021. And uh, thanks COVID, you've finally let us come out and about. And, and we... you have food on your face. Oh, do I? Um, <laughs> I'm going. I can't seem to find the right lighting. <laughs> we'll just go with it. Okay. Ooh. Hello Chris. and welcome to Hexham Camp Draft. It is December 2021 and uh, thanks COVID you've finally let us come out and about. And, and you have food on your face. Oh do I? Um, okay so take two. Uh, I've got food off my face. <laughs> there we go. Uh, obviously we're a bit rusty. It's been a while since we've done a vlog um, but we're finally back at a draft so we thought maybe we'd do another one. Um, ooh, I've been madly, this weekend I have been madly judging as well as riding. So on the upside, all the horses are really good to crack the whip off, which is uh, a step up. And I think that's more that uh, I've actually put a lot of practice in learning how to crack the whip better this winter. So I'm not quite as shit at it. <laughs> um, so what have I done? I've had maiden runs on Pokey and Cobalt. Um, Kobe just had a little cruise around, which was really good. And Pokey was working really well in the camp, so I was happy with him. Talk to him. Hey guys, welcome back to Hexham. We have uh, had runs and thrills and no spills so far, so happy days with that. But it's only midday. That's right, there's still plenty of time left. Um, yeah, um, happy days. Bill. Uh, Got a ribbon in the open yesterday, just bringing out proper legend status. That's what I like to see. Little horses are going pretty good. Um, happy with them. Haven't been bucked off. Kobe's just starting out, so happy days. We'll see. I'm sure it'll get better. What about you, Mia? Oh, I've just been eating snacks, riding baby horses. Got a new oh. one on the track this weekend. Yeah, what? Which new horse did you bring? We've got Diamond. Some of you will have seen her before, but this is her first time off the place. Yeah, and uh, it's been going good. And Love and life. Did she, did she make the novice? Oh no! Did she make the maiden final? She did. She made she? the maiden final. Yeah, she got on a, a casual forty-five. 45. <laughs> That's right. She got a score of forty-five. Made the maiden final, and but then got another score in the final. Put she ran one over the back of the gate at the final. So she is fantastic. Now Diamond is actually Cobalt's auntie. Yes. So there you go. That's pretty exciting. We're not socially awkward at all. <laughs> <laughs> no, not at all. <laughs> not at all. See, we'll see if we can give you a little bit of uh, behind the scenes at the draft and what's going on. Um, Hexham's great. Weather's, we had a couple of showers yesterday, but today, oh, sunny and brilliant. So bring it on. Bring on more drafting. Yay. Yay. Okay, we're watching 14. Mia Malone, you can see her Thank you to the Midfield Group for the donation of these uh, beautiful creatures here. 
exciting times. Check out the crew, the camp draft crew for this season. We've got obviously Bill, like legend, legend of the team, just doing his thing in the open again, now at Open Horse. And now we've got the new member of the team, this. This is Cobalt, Creekview Cobalt, if you want his real name. Kobe's just starting out in his little maiden horse, so hopefully we're going to just have some little trots around and nice cruisy little cattle for him. And um, yeah, let's fingers crossed he ends up being really well, doing good. And who have we got here? Oh, hello Pokey. This is Pokey, coming back for his probably like second proper season. Um, he's just decided that he does like cattle, so he's just starting to want to work in the camp, which has been really good. So yeah, hopefully he... Um, just keeps on improving and um, we'll see how that goes. We'll let you know. Oh, really? Yeah. Yeah. Really? Yeah. How many months? What's the reason for that? Yeah, I don't really know. I think it's just. I don't know. You might know that. Yeah, I'll, do that. I'll ask you in a minute. <laughs> Have a good ride round of them. Come and have a look at this little black fella in the, the second one then. So we're having a recap after Cobalt's novice run. He came out of the camp really steady, awesome. Trot, 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 stepped up to a counter. Uh, he shied at the, around the first peg, he shied at the dust of the calf made. And anyway, then he decided, yep, yeah, I'll canter up again. So he cantered, came around the bottom of the second peg and then he, he was doing pretty good. And then he decided, then he lost his listening ears, came around the bottom of the second peg and went, wow, I just want to run. And I was like, uh, steady up, mate. And he's like, no, I really want to run. So just lost his listening ears. Yeah. 
Whoops, sorry. Whoops, slipped off the log. Oh, sorry. Is he cool? Best place to watch watch your draft is from on top of a horse. Just watching the open final here. Billy got an 86 in the in the go round, so we just missed the final by two points. So guys, we're back from Hexham Camp Draft. I've unhooked the gooseneck, I've just backed the ute into the shed, and now I've got to do like a bazillion loads of washing and heaps of unpacking and all the fun stuff that comes when you get home from a camp draft. Um, it was an awesome weekend. Oh my god, it was um, it was actually really just had the best vibe, just so chilled out and um, such a great draft to go to. I was a bit, I found that I was a little bit tired, but then I'm pretty sure I did something in nearly every event. If I wasn't judging, I was riding. So I think the only spell I got was uh, the Maiden Series, which was great to watch. Um, so the Western District branch of the Australian Stock Horse Society actually put the Hexham draft on. Um, massive thanks to the committee there, guys. You did a fantastic job. Your cattle were awesome. And it was a really good weekend, so please, please, please run another one next year so we can come. It's super close to home and um, such a fun weekend. Uh, I can't wait to see the photos because Riley had a Riley was sitting on Bill in the lineup for the open for open, so um, I can't wait to see some photos of her sitting in the lineup there. Um, Dad had a really good weekend. He was wrapped to get back drafting, even though he was as rusty as an old plowshare and his timing was super off because he hadn't drafted in two years. Um, since having a back injury and then back surgery and recovering from surgery and then COVID, all that stuff jamming together. So um, yeah, we just had a wow of time. Our young, Mia and I both had young horses, um, Cobalt and Diamond. They went so good, so bingo, bango. Let's get drafting, COVID, get lost. No one's interested in you anymore. Let's get out there and get amongst it. Um, and we hope to see you back and Please, if you haven't subscribed, subscribe, give us a like and a follow, all that kind of stuff on Instagram and YouTube. And we'll try and send you some more videos soon. See you later.